More than 1,200 employees were idled at the JBS meatpacking plant in the Cache Valley yesterday. Haley Higgins has an in-depth look at the local impact of that cyber attack. And a major city yet to be determined in Russia. Through federal filings, we confirmed the numbers on 12 funds, each with more than one web domain owned by the LDS Church. The funds control about $31.9 billion in investments. The Travis Wayne Goodsell. Uh, so, first item of business. Uh, Mormons are uh, not behaving properly. I did the video for ex-Mormons, not Mormons. I was not attacking Joseph Smith. What were you doing putting a thumbs down and running away? Well, apparently you think the church is awesome. The church would never sabotage the Mormons. Yeah, well, no. It's now confirmed that as Nelson has uh, made a deal with Russia and the two of them are working together for profit as uh, the church had uh, received money from Russia and then laundered it into the, the stock market as the church has profited off of the coronavirus uh, if you go to the uh, link for the uh, companies that uh, the church has in Enzyme Peak Associates where the whistleblower uh, exposed them. Uh, Johnson & Johnson and Pfizer are stocks in that portfolio. Moderna is not, but you know Moderna was uh, developed by the uh, young black woman. So, could that have anything to do with it? Certainly not. I'm sure the church leaders are no longer racist. We allow blacks in the church now. It was not done by revelation. <laughs> Just an official declaration. So I'm sure that has nothing to do with it. But, uh, yeah, JBS. When I found out from Fox 13 News Utah that that plant was part of the hack by a group working in Russia, thus protected by Russia, and given orders by Putin. You can't just be in Russia and do whatever you want. You have to be under orders of Putin. That's why you don't do business in Russia. Otherwise, you're his slave. You work for Putin. You do what he tells you to do. And so that's why it's so vital that Mormons understand that when the church came out and said, hey, we're going to have a temple here someday, we just haven't had the details worked out. Yeah, that's because Putin wants to show or wants to find out how really bad you want it. And thus the $32 billion was given and laundered in the stock market. That's why Nelson did away with the high priest group. That's why he did away with home teaching. That's why he raised an idol god for Mormons. That's why he said he's the Antichrist. Catching on, or do I need to include coronavirus, etc.? The church is compromised. They are doing the will of Russia. How do I make this more clear to you? The question is whether they're doing it willingly or unwillingly. I know Mormons are going to say, oh, unwillingly. 
So yeah, you admit he's compromised. Okay, good. We're improving. <clears throat> but yeah, the FBI came out today and confirmed that the JBS hack was indeed by the same company that pulled the solar winds attack. You see what's going on, Mormons? JBS is in Hiram, up there in the Logan area. It also had the scandal last year of a coronavirus outbreak, but refusing to shut down and refusing people to go home so that it kept being a problem until it was eventually forced to shut down until it got taken care of. Yeah, I bet you missed that in the news. And so, yeah, we're under attack. Section 101, starting in verse 43. The enemy is here. They're attacking. It's a cyber attack, not a physical one, not bombs, not guns, not knives, not cannons not swords cyber attack with a computer hack they can shut down our power they can shut down our food they can shut down our communications internet we are at war this is it Joseph Smith was right so I don't know why Mormons are all upset with me. I don't know why Mormons are putting the thumbs down. Joseph Smith is true. He's right. The church is evil. There is no other way to explain it, Mormons. That's Joseph Smith. It's not me. If you don't know this, you're not studying your scriptures. You're just going to church through the motions because the church will never teach that they're bad. <laughs> Dear God. So, there you go. Russia has ordered an attack on Mormons, fulfilling Joseph Smith's prophecy. And he's going to get worse. See, solar winds, Mormon Utah. That's down in uh, Orem, I think it is, or is it Ogden? I think it's Orem. Ogden? Orem? I had obtained the picture, I did the videos, but it's been so long now. <laughs> it's been a few months. <laughs> a few thousand videos earlier. So, yep, there she blows.